But it's not just your skin you should be worried about. Health experts say high temperatures and high humidity can be a dangerous combination as your body may struggle to cool itself. Dr. Michael Schuf says there are three main different heat experiences. Those include dehydration, when you start to feel thirsty, heat exhaustion, when you are excessively sweating, feeling clammy and weak, and the most severe category is heat stroke, when you're having more damage to your body due to the heat exposure. One of the worrisome things is then as you get the heat stroke is you stop sweating or at least stop sweating as much. And some people think, well, that's a good thing. Hey, look, I'm acclimatizing to this heat so well, I'm not sweating as much. No, that's a bad thing. You're very dehydrated. Your body is shutting down on you when you're not sweating. Other symptoms of a heat stroke include confusion, slurred speech, and even chills. You also need to go in an emergency room right away or call 911. And remember to stay cool, stay hydrated, and stay informed.